Now, in terms of, so at least, you know, I, I guess that's a, that's a positive then at least is that they're all very excited to be back and, you know, they're not, you're not seeing so much of a mental stress. Um, how about in terms of physical development, in terms of some of the milestones that you'd be expecting them to meet based on their phys ed statewide requirements? How, is, is, are they caught up or are you noticing a delay there? I'm going to say we have a lot of work we're going to be doing next year, getting them caught up a little bit on that. Um, you know, I, I feel this year having that piece of like, and I know the remote teaching is not the same for everybody. And I found for me personally that it, I, I feel like I've been flourishing with it. And like it's been really good to the, her back feedback from the parents and the kids. Um, because for me, it's not just like, Hey, I post my stuff and I don't see the kids, you know, it's not like, Hey, come on live. And some kids are screaming off or whatever it we've had the continuity since day one which i feel like has helped and again putting us on the class dojo platform for my k2 kids um because we, we split it this year so my co-teacher is doing three five i'm doing k2 um and it wasn't a whole logistical with the schedule this year but you know my k2 kid um i'm creating like google slides for every lesson right so say we're, say we're doing a unit and it's 10 classes long um the way that they did the schedule this year to limit exposure in school, um, we see, like say, uh, right now, I'm in kindergarten right now, uh, 10 days in a row of kindergarten, two weeks. And, and then and I see first grade for two weeks. And then I see second grade for two weeks. And then it's back to kindergarten for two weeks. So it's a little different than normal because normally you'd see every, every grade, every class twice a week for 40 minutes. And this year we're doing it a little different, the sister show. So, um, for me, you know, seeing their development, I'd say we're, you know, average moving up the line, but definitely not to where an in-person lesson could be, you know, done and, and the, the growth. But we've we've tried to hit home lifetime fitness this whole year. So tying in a ton of fitness stuff into every lesson, into, you know, every and, and for, it's cool because like Monday through Friday, I'm seeing the same, same grade. And I get to kind of, I've created it where it's like Mindful Monday, um, two for Tuesday, because this or that, uh, Wonder What Wednesday. And I, yeah, I talk about a quote with the kids and how it ties into like character ed. And then Thursday, it's about a Thursday and Friday, fun Friday with like challenges um, we've been. And each lesson like 20, 25 minutes long, Google slide, screen share, split screen. And even though I'm not synchronous, I'm on the one half of the screen in my small picture, in my picture, and then the slides on the other side. So it's, it's really worked um, for this year, you know, and, and um, we've done like our jump rope, you know, say, so for jump rope at home, um, every kid has mastered the basics, right? In a normal world, we would be doing these like creative routines and stuff. And I offered it this year, but to have the, um, the tangible like to be there with the kid and work with them and have that accountability of like hey i'm doing a b c d but they're on their own you know we're in school they can kind of see somebody else do something and maybe they felt they couldn't then it might help push them more um but you know we're not we we chose to not do like go in and do like straight on like hard data assessment for all the different levels because again some of us are like some of the kids maybe are doing it on their own some might have a parent or whoever's working with them kind of helping them out and like you know so is it really their data is it really them doing it or are they getting the extra assist, you know help so this year we just kind of like wanted to expose them wanted to give them all these things kind of make it fun and like lifetime piece and maybe tie the parents into working with them and getting that you know so we kind of spun it a little bit knowing that next year we kind of fill in the gaps a little bit and try to bring them back to where we want to get them.